What's up guys, Felix here from Vemify. In this tutorial, I will show you how to install and apply a LUT in Premiere Pro on a Mac. For this tutorial, I'm using our tomography LUT pack. Let's dive into Premiere Pro. A really fast way is to go to the Lumetri Color section here, go to Creative, drop down this menu here at Look and hit on Browse. Open your downloaded folder, go to LUTs and in the most cases we have here your files with a cube ending. This is the industry standard for lookup tables. Select one of your LUTs, let's say the drip one for this example and here you are. As you can see, it is really easy to apply a LUT this way. But sometimes the browsing process to find your perfect look is time consuming. Therefore, you have the option to bring all your LUTs here in this section. Therefore, you have to open your finder, go to Applications and search for your Premiere Pro version. In this case, it's Premiere Pro 2020. Hit a right click here on this Adobe Premiere Pro symbol and select Show Package Contents. After this step you will find a Contents folder. Open the Contents folder, go to Lumetri, go to LUTs and select the Creative folder. And this is the folder where we want to paste our cube files. So here for a better overview, open your LUT pack and here you have your cube files. Select all of them. Hit Command C on your keyboard, go to the Creative folder and hit Command V on your keyboard. Ok, now to allow this you have to enter your password. Now let's go back to Premiere Pro and restart Premiere Pro. And now after the restart go to Lumetri Color, open Creative and as you can see all of your LUTs are installed right here. So I think this workflow is really easy. And here is my last tip for using lookup tables. Create a new adjustment layer. Let's go here, adjustment layer, ok. And drag and drop the adjustment layer above your footage. And if you want to apply one LUT on every single clip here, you can apply the LUT just right here on the adjustment layer. For some edits the adjustment layer workflow is a real time saver. So you have to apply your LUT once and you have the effect on every clip in your timeline. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and feel free to leave a comment below, hit the like and the subscribe button and check out my tutorial playlist for more helpful videos for video creators. So see you soon, stay tuned, Felix from Vemify.